Hi, welcome back to my cup of TV with Jenny and Erin. Who saw a tease? They were so good. I was just like. I was like a statue, but inside <laughs> my I it was like fireworks, it was like wow, but my face yeah. was just everyone else around me was moving and chanting and screaming i was just like outer body experience it's because they were just so close jenny played a very dangerous gambling game it paid off and found seats that were like third row like basically on the stage the thing was, it's because we're third row next to the stage, but because of where the stage is and where the um, face the rows start, we were basically level with standing on the stage. So they were like <laughs> eye contact, just level with us. So she did that, didn't say anything. Luckily, managed to sell our other tickets, but then only told us as we were in the queue. She's like, "Do you remember where we're sitting?" I was like, "One oh one." something somewhere and she was like you were like up the, up the back of the yeah, and you were like not anymore <laughs> <laughs> so excuse me yes. so then when we sat down no it's when we went in and you're like where were the seats supposed to be I'm like this is w follow me <laughs> yeah <laughs> but i do i do remember that i was sat there and i was just staring at the, the bit of the stage that juts out and you you was, must have been saying something to me and i just <laughs> Like glass eyed, and I was like, "Oh, sorry, I, I am." Like they spent. Oh, I feel like we had. I feel like our side of the stage mm-hmm. got treated better. Now, to be fair, I wasn't watching. Yeah, to be fair, I wasn't watching what was going on. But on the I. Side. But I feel like we were spoiled. I, I was not prepared for how close they were, for how much they were interacting. Yeah. with us how well they sang live how well they danced live how amazing their english was how and funny and chaotic they are yeah and how loud yeah it <laughs> the was crowd were no but i've watched these videos many many times since the concert it's been two days um because every time i watch it i spot something new and there is a video that obviously we're gonna see and someone said to me, what are ATs like in concert? I would show them like, Hala Hala, which I don't have a good video of, I'm afraid. Um, and then I would show them From, you know, the second to last song. Yes. And I would just say, just rewind, watch that member. Rewind, watch that member. <laughs> it's chaos. And it's it just personally sums up ATs. <laughs> yeah, they, they were chaotic and... In I the loved, best way. I loved seeing their little interactions that they had. Yeah. And especially where we were sat as well. And I'm a terrible person for this because there'll be loads of things going on, but something will catch my eye. Mm. And so I missed bits because I was watching them walk off backstage and just how calm they were. Just being yeah. off the side, like having a drink, like having their makeup done and then slapping straight back into a song. Yeah. How professional to be able to to do that i'd be like am i gonna miss my cue yeah like, i'm ready i'm ready yeah, no, counting down they, to it they were yeah. just like i was watching them da, 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 in yeah like, and the other little high fives they were doing to i have to say it's other. one of the things that i love most when you can be close enough to really see this in the concerts they all look like they are having the best time yeah. they are genuinely having so much fun and that's the best thing too, because again, like you said, when you see them go off stage a bit, at no point were they looking really tired or did they go, ah, off stage, miserable. They were just, I think, after they left the stage, I even turned to you, I believe, and said, I bet you, you know, he's still dancing down the stairs on his way out because <laughs> the man didn't stop. Yeah, because I don't know if I saw it, but I know people said they were like, Look, there, they were watching the crowd beforehand. Yeah, you could see them through the screens when the yeah. light hit it right. You could see them. They were watching everyone. And to be honest, the first section for me, I don't know. Yes. 
so we are going to watch some concert videos. This is like a reaction review, unloading our experience. Um, the first section I have some videos of, but the quality is really poor because I got a new phone just for concerts. I said, I didn't get it just for concerts. I chose this one just for concerts. <laughs> I'm not made of money. <laughs> <laughs> um, and I hadn't sorted out the settings yet. Yeah. And I couldn't stop partway through that section because I didn't want to miss anything. So the video quality isn't great. I can't even tell you what songs they... I don't even know what song they came out to. New World. You haven't done that one yet. Okay, maybe that's why. <laughs> it's just... That's a little step. But hey, we're gonna back some videos talk through what it was like and what we're spotting in the videos that we didn't spot when it was happening because we don't have enough pairs of eyes when some are going on that stage some are here you just so i will be uploading these videos i have some up there already but on youtube so you can watch each song i did try to put it all together in one concert video like i did last time but it was over an hour <laughs> and so i thought maybe not maybe i'll put them up individually now i'm excited about this one because this is the first one that they did of crowd interaction this is the one where you'll see where i spoke to erin and then we almost there. and my <laughs> camera work shows what a state of shock i was in <laughs> i had just turned to erin and said check out the woo booty and there he was and now you see <laughs> body parts not faces because i was just you know he's a flirt by the way oh yeah Between the two. I know. Yes, thanks, Lurkin. Yes, sir. I liked the choreo on this one. It's very swaggy in places. I feel like you could do this as well. I now drawn to you know though in this choreo because he just like he's having the best time. Is this bit where they put like the hand in the pocket bit? <laughs> the bit of that that's the one I mean. <laughs> Hit work. I'm embarrassed of my behaviour. But you watch, he's waving at me, I'm telling you. Ready? There. See? <laughs> and John Ho's there to judge me as always. <laughs> oh dear. No. Sam knows he should stay a safe distance. Yeah. <laughs> He's like, I heard this all about how they could reach us. He's like, I come away, but you're a bit crazy. I'm not coming any closer. Oh, the tops of their water bottles are purple as well. Oh. They looked black, so, I think. You know. I had so much fun having you know around. <laughs> look at him. <it>, just... <laughs> but if you watch him with the choreo here, he does his sideways at one point when everyone else is facing forward just because he's doing it to us. Look, see? <laughs> <laughs> it's just so fun. <laughs> the effort to make us feel like we're yeah. a part of it is crazy. Sorry, I just noticed something. Look at the side eye. I say when I say we, I don't mean us personally, I mean as the crowd. <laughs> Look at the side eye we get from Sam. <laughs> Look. <laughs> Look. He's just... <laughs> Flicking his head. Mingy, he's just too cool, isn't he? Oh, so much. Oh, give me your thing. What? 
Watch John Ho and Mingy now. <laughs> Again, I'm, I'm going to pause it because we're getting into the sections where I'm like, now look at this bit, look at this bit. So we saw Minky hit John Ho's yeah. back. <laughs> Lucky it was probably going, like, oh, it's the face. He's just like, fuck. Like, what are you, how dare you interrupt my pristine vocals? Part of me wants to laugh. Part of me is scared for Minky. <laughs> Have, has he been seen again since? That boy. <laughs> um, yeah, we've got the Minky mic moment. But there's a just cute bit because oh, I'm on the pools. There's a cute bit between Songma and Yasai. Just being cute. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I love how they can click from whatever they're interacting and doing, yeah. suddenly they're in their choreo positions. For me, it's the fact that, like I said there with you know, carries on his choreo, but I'm gonna switch it around here and grin at you while I do it. Yeah. <laughs> Him actually out of all of them, I felt was probably the best at crowd interaction because he's able to do it at all times. Like he was coming out of position and walking around to his new position, but he'd be doing it whilst like, hey to you, you know. Whereas the others I think were a bit more focused on like gotta to get to here. He was very much like, woohoo. Or he was dancing while he did it. Like, <laughs> I mean, he was just having, at one of them, he was having the time of he his life. He did really like he was, yeah, like living his best life. You know, walked nowhere. He danced everywhere. <laughs> he just like appeared. Everywhere. But there are other times in other songs where I notice him interacting or mucking around, and then he just goes bam straight into choreo. I'm like how? What? Yeah. And he literally jumps into position. That's exactly. They, they're they so professional at what they do and yeah. so skilled. They've been... And I suppose we're, we're a chunk into the tour, yeah. so they are so, like, drilled in with it that they can give you all of that performance value, the vocals, all of that stuff, like, a star value, but also... Yeah. In their down moments be there for us they could easily they are gonna be exhausted come on they're yeah. performing they're singing yeah. they're all eyes are on them yes there'll be an element of adrenaline but they could easily like take a beat have a yeah. breath and look around take in but no they use those moments to enhance our experience yeah when they're already giving so much so every little look and glance and wave i just felt immensely grateful for yeah i mean we got so much because of where we were but just being able to come away at any point and be like i made eye contact with one of them you know wow but obviously all of those bits are going to have been on the screens yeah so everyone would still get that get to see some of those yeah those bits and it's so lovely because you know i've sat like not I have sat right back back in the yeah, O2 I which is terrifying but yeah. like the first time I saw Blackpink I was in one of like the th- on the third floor and it is how idols interact with yeah. the crowd that actually whether you're where we were or anywhere else you feel involved and you feel seen do you and know that's what the such is? a value um, as someone who went to a different concert recently, that concert I there was there and I watched a show, I watched a performance. Here, it's like you've come to be with other Atinis and just to have a fun time with ATs. It's yeah. It doesn't feel like we're here to perform and you're here to watch us. It's like we're here, we're going to sing our songs, we're all just going to party together. Do you know what I mean? It felt very it's much like that. As much as for you as it is for them. Yeah. Uh, and yeah, I've got I've got a concert next week, um, and <laughs> in the O2 as well, and that's yeah. gonna feel that's gonna feel very different. JD also raised something um, after I went to my last concert, and she said, "Did it feel weird without light sticks?" Oh yes, it did. It felt really weird. It felt really bad. <laughs> Illusion.
confusion. Now, this is where the blooms came out. Now, I said this in a comment to someone on TikTok. I feel like at KQ Entertainment, they were planning the tour and they're like, I want to add something in, something fun. They're like, well, what can we do? You know, that's okay. I'll take, they're a group of boys. Well, Young's there. What are we going to do? <laughs> and then they're like, balloons. They can't do any damage with balloons. <laughs> they can. Yeah. And they do. It's what happens when you give a group of children a big space and big balloons. <laughs> well, to be fair, illusion wasn't too bad. It was wave web. <laughs> oh, yeah, wave, wave went <laughs> crazy. Brilliant. But uh, yeah, this was illusion when they first came out. And can I say, you know, with a giant bloom, it's a puppy who won't let go of his ball. That's what that is. <laughs> See, this way you're saying to his jacket. Oh, those confetti cannons terrified oh, me. Yeah. Made me jump. <laughs> it was Jocko's little smiley does there. <laughs> he was definitely a cutie. I wasn't expecting him to be so cute. It's a fun song though, so. <laughs> <laughs> you see how far John Poe travels? Exactly! Uh, and I'm pretty sure it's him that gets over there on the other side. I think it's because John Poe sends me towards the back for choreo stuff because he's not going as hard. So, no, I disagree. And then he moves forward to hit his note. I disagree. A lot of times I saw him on one of the points of the triangle. Mm -hmm. Because I, I take your point, but yeah, I was then because I thought, oh, and then sand goes hard enough for everybody. Oh yeah, see, <laughs> you know, it just doesn't stop. <laughs> Don't come to get a balloon. It's stuck. <laughs> Show me no mask. Oh, I was watching him do that. I, I missed this bit because I was watching him get the balloon. I don't worry, I'll go back to that. But you're saying was that. <laughs> it's when they all stroll around and then bam, they're doing choreo. So you know. <laughs> I have to get it again. It's also interesting actually to see the choreo from this angle. It is. So pretty. It, like, he's so dangerous. Who are you watching? <laughs> I was watching, um, was it Sam thing? and... Where's my mouse gone? <laughs> my mouse is gone. But yeah, you saw what was happening with Yuno and Sam. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Watch Yuno with this blue and he just can't leave it. <laughs> I mean, it's like a dog with a ball. You know they've got it in their mouth and they want to pick something up in the car. <laughs> I feel like Mingy's jacket in this it gave me like super rich yeah. guy that would he puts that jacket on but would wear like ripped open trainers and just like go to a drive through <laughs> or something with like tons of money but also like other than like this cool jacket the rest of him's like super <laughs> cash so that's a nice mix I think of the fact you've got quite fun choreo and mucking around in it but you'll still watch them do that choreo like wow yeah exciting news people you may have missed this news 
So don't skip this bit because it's exciting news. It is. For Atini, not just us, the rest of Atini. Uh, you may have seen our videos from BTS and Stray Kid Club Nights in London. BTS Club Night is coming! Just a night full of 80s songs. 80s. Eight, nothing but 80s, just all night. And just all 18 or all the fandom and just yes. everyone us just an opportunity to meet sing yeah dance. meet friends just gush along with how yeah. much you love them here like yeah. the songs that you're gonna want to hear and just be with all together is the closest thing you're gonna get to a concert yeah that's that's how i think of it it's basically you can bring your light stick you can bring gifts for every teeny my, like yeah. sometimes there are like photo cards and stickers like there's a very amazing DJ oh yeah and he knows to dance yes he often knows bits of choreo I might have a word and see if he'll learn some cyberpunk for us I'm sure we can <laughs> rustle up yeah. a chair yeah we'll find a chair I can be a chair <laughs> yeah <laughs> poor Sonny <laughs> he'll be like Jenny's bad <sighs> but you know a lot of people do know Korea and they do yeah. the crowds and it's just it's such a great atmosphere and one for 80s just a whole night of 80s yeah even if you are like oh I don't know anyone trust me come along we'll be there we'll be there come with us you can know us and you will make friends it's yeah. I cannot explain how amazing these nights are I think it's the 22nd of April yeah 22nd I will put a link in the comments comments description there'll be a link the tickets and obviously the full information and uh yeah we will be there like we said if you don't have anyone to go with just come we'll be there and come with us so next is is wave this may have some pauses in because it's going to be a lot of shit to watch <laughs> yes <sighs> this was another one of those actually with the crowd interaction where it was like ah someone's here i need to film oh what's going on over here so and also, the amount of times I've rewatched this as well, I'm like, Wave might be my favourite song of theirs, I think. Here he comes! <laughs> it's, the way, it's the way he walks around with it. Yeah. <laughs> it's so big on it's him. like he's making sure that everywhere has one, though. <laughs> it's like he looks straight at you. <laughs> See what I mean? <laughs> it's kind of unnerving. <laughs> and then my camera work goes to shit because your settings there. His hair. Here comes the flirt. <laughs> <laughs> but you see what I mean when I said to you earlier? I just want to party with him. Oh yeah. I go to like a giant soft play. I think I can even hear myself screaming yeah. that. <laughs> the power that that man has. Look at him. Mingy. <laughs> You know there's a, a Mingy stand behind us. <laughs> yeah. Now this is where you need to watch. <laughs> is there a celebration <laughs> afterwards as well? Yeah, you help him, you know, or do that. It's the high five as well. <laughs> Just And then at one point you um your son gets hit in the face by a balloon that's thrown up. <laughs> No, no, yeah, it's when he's walking around. Mingy! Yeah. <laughs> it's here, like, look at all cash, and then bam! <laughs> and so they jump into yeah. it. I loved the rainbows of the light oh, sticks yeah. in this bit. That, that was my favourite, like, light stick effect. I just, this is just my favourite song, I think, of those, confirmed. He's now, if you follow your sang in a minute, first he's gonna flirt with John Poe. <laughs> <laughs> now, follow your sang. 
<laughs> you imagine if you threw that, how bad you'd be. Give a thumbs up because obviously you would have done it. Like, Fuck. No, see the tits. Fuck, it's nothing. I know. Why. I said, I, I said, do you think there's a speaker just in his chest somewhere? <laughs> Like I said, I don't know whether it's just because of that performance. I already obviously love the song. Oh, yeah. But, and I think once you've heard, I you know what, they did do it at the last concert, but I didn't know the song then. So this time it really like, <clears throat> was uplifting and I really, the whole room felt it. Yeah, because you can get the vibe like, yeah. from it as well. And everyone was just, just dancing, the light sticks are going, all colours. Yeah, it was such, the atmosphere was, yeah. we could have gone and done <laughs> anything. Yeah. At that point. And that moment you were laughing at with San and you know, I didn't spot that until earlier today. Like. <laughs> that was very funny. <laughs> I was like, what is happening after that? You see what I mean? Someone like KQ, what harm can they do with balloons? <laughs> yeah. Have they had the balloons at all of them? Yeah. I saw a TikTok where someone was obviously on the floor and they were filming and Mingy kicked a balloon and it just comes out the camera, bang. <laughs> okay, what I want to know is, by the time the tour finishes, who's been hit the most number of times? How many, like, knockouts have we had? <laughs> <laughs> and who's been able to launch the balloons the furthest? That's, I'd like a summary of I the think experience. What I loved most about the Wu Young, Jong Ho, Hong Jun incident is that it hits Jong Ho in the face and bounces off him yet he's still there to laugh with Wu Young <laughs> yeah that balloon yeah. that balloon was like better <laughs> damage him 